Amsterdam is known as Venice of the North because of its lovely canals that crisscross the city, its impressive architecture and more than 1500 bridges. Here you'll find dozens of art museums like the Van Gogh Museum, Ritz Museum, beautiful parks, lots of history. If you love art, you must see the Night Watch at the Ritz. The Night Watch is one of the most famous Dutch Golden Age paintings. This city is by far one of the most beautiful in the world. Few cities rival Athens when it comes to historical importance. Athens is still dominated by 5th century BC landmarks including the Acropolis, a hilltop citadel topped with ancient buildings like the Parthenon Temple. The Acropolis Museum along with the National Archaeological Museum preserve sculptures, vases, jewelries and more from ancient Greece. Home of the Ancient Pharaohs Egypt is a dazzling destination of temples and tombs that woe all who visit. Ever since I was a child, I always had the utmost desire to visit Egypt. Reading countless books and watching movies on pyramids and mummies, I feel that desire even more. Finally, when I did visit Egypt, it certainly lived up to my expectations. The Egyptian Museum in Cairo houses over 120,000 artifacts, including the contents of Tutankhamun's tomb. And most of the mummies that have been discovered since the 19th century. The last surviving of the seven wonders of the ancient world, the pyramids of Giza are one of the world's most recognizable landmarks. Built as tombs for the mighty pharaohs, and guarded by the enigmatic Sphinx, Giza's pyramid complex has awed travelers down through the ages. Alexandria attractions never fail to lure tourists from across the globe. And today, the area has become one of Egypt's tourism hotspots. Notable in Alexandria include the Catacombs, National Museum, Pompeii Pillar, and the new library of Alexandria, which is also home to world-class art galleries and an amazing planetarium. Explore the Valley of Kings, home to more than 60 royal tombs, including that of Tutankhamun, venture through Valley of Queens, marvel at the splendor of Queen Hatshepsut's mortuary temple, gaze upon Luxor temple, and discover Karnak, the largest temple complex ever constructed. Luxor tourist attractions can best be described as an overload of ancient Egyptian sites. Barcelona, sited between the sea and the mountains, has found a formidable balance. The city is indeed a major cultural center with a remarkable history. It abounds with archives, libraries, museums and buildings of interest. Gaudi's unparalleled UNESCO-listed La Sagrada Familia inspires awe by its sheer verticality. Work began in 1882 and is hoped to be completed in 2026, a century after the architect's death. I loved walking around the city seeing the world's first ever submarine, the Olympic Village, and the beautiful Park Gou. Barcelona is indeed an all-around spectacular city. Welcome to a capital city whose story goes back at least 3,000 years. In Beijing, you'll find a wealth of history, both ancient such as the Summer Palace, Forbidden City, and more recent such as Chairman Mao Memorial Hall, Tianmen Square. A visit to the Great Wall, the longest man-made structure in the world, is absolutely essential. Instead of going to the tourist side of the wall, my guide actually took me to a rural side. We literally had to climb a huge hill to get to the wall. 
I remember a local farmer helping me along the way. When we got there, the view was breathtaking. An easy day trip from Beijing are the tombs of 13 Ming Dynasty emperors, arranged according to Feng Shui across a lush valley once sealed off to the living by an 80 kilometer wall. Having spent 12 years of my life in London, I could say it holds a very special place in my heart. I got my university degrees in London, practically spent my entire 20s in a city that offers so much in terms of culture and history. Countless visits to the British Museum National History Museum Sherlock Holmes Museum It's little wonder London is one of the world's top tourist destinations attracting a part of 20 million visitors each year from around the world. It offers one of the planet's greatest concentrations of cultural attractions. From royal palaces to the People's Parliament, from museums and cathedrals to riding a giant ferry's wheel for breathtaking views over the River Thames would spend endless days exploring London's best sightseeing locations without ever running out of unique things to see and do. The Vatican City is an independent state, the world's smallest with only 0.44 square kilometers. But within its walls are enough attractions and things to do to keep tourists busy for several days. So prioritizing your sightseeing is important. Two must-see sites are St. Peter's Basilica and the Sistine Chapel. But the Vatican Palace contains magnificent rooms decorated by the greatest artists of their time, as well as priceless collections in more than a dozen museums.